Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Soul Eater episode number 12. Now in the previous episode um, we got to uh, see like that previous episode was extremely like emotional and quite good like uh, in emotional aspect that was one of the best uh, episode I've seen in Soul Eater up until now like up until the 10 episodes so like there have been a lot of funny episodes but like from uh, what do you call it from a feels type from an emotional type uh, of thing uh, that comes like that takes the top spot and uh, like uh, that was really good and uh, like thankfully um, Suba uh, Subaki kind of uh, was able to sort out the thing with her brother and uh, I hope that uh, like this thing doesn't like come back and like she doesn't have to face anything like this again like any more family matters I don't know if she has any other family members or not or even if they are alive but like um, I hope that <laughs> the family problems kind of stop now because she rightly resolved it with her with her brother and uh, her brother like uh, and she kind of consumed she also consumed in her brother's soul which was like becoming a uh, was like becoming a kishin so yeah and thankfully like <laughs> blackstar got his first soul <laughs> and he's a long way to go so yeah uh, without further ado let's get started with episode number um 12 yeah 12 of soul eater and uh, i'll be putting the timer and the uh, uh, countdown uh, here sync it to which uh, god damn it i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync it to whichever is a preference let's get started ah okay um i'll be counting down three two one go it's just a sec okay <clears throat> All right. Who is making spells? Is this Medusa? No. Witches mass. Wow, so many witches. Okay, so that was like some kind of big shot of the witches who was doing the spell. A new character? Hmm. Okay, so we're getting some new characters here. Alright. Like um, the feeling I'm getting from the, these uh, episodes is like kid is more of like what do you call it uh, a senior type character like he kind of comes in when there is some kind of problems like uh, who helps the other guys or other main characters because obviously he's a lot experienced a lot more experienced than the black star and uh, Maka Soul so like um i don't know if he's like uh like he's pretty strong black um, kid so like i don't know like he, probably he'll like face uh enemies who, who are like far stronger than soul maka and black star subaki uh people who are they are unable to defeat or something like that i don't know i'm, I'm just guessing because there's a huge difference in sk uh, skill and experience between these two characters and kid so yeah let's see <laughs> okay, this guy's paranoid <laughs> elka frog okay so she's like a frog tiny one okay oh okay okay she's here I forgot her name
Madame de Montna. Okay. Oh my god, that coat is flashy. Maba, okay. Maba. Hmm, yeah, kind of, but I doubt he'll make a mistake. She'll make a mistake. Okay. Uh. Oh my god. Damn, this girl is. Oh my. Mm. Yeah, definitely. Oh my god, what? Okay, they are like frog and rats, isn't it? Mouse. And she's like a snake, so definitely she'll come on top. God damn, my nose is itching. Ah. Mm, because of that, um, Ragnarok. Is, is it because of that? Okay. He appears. In Damn. We seen this guy in the opening. Yeah. Jiraiya's voice actor. Mm. So is this guy like the personification of Ragnarok or something? Like his blood? So this is like something of his like hidden power or something? I think Yeah, okay Like is something bad happening outside? Oh, okay Oh yeah, okay, so Wow, this is quite a weird dream Yeah, like after that this, these are all happening Hmm Yeah, her like, um, she's feeling responsible and like because of a lack of strength. Oh my god, what is this? Soul solving. Oh. So it will like suck in your wavelength or something? 
aku. Hmm. Oh ya. Yeah. Oh, so this for the training, okay. All right. <laughs> yes, definitely. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, Blair is sitting. I, I didn't notice. Hmm. Okay, it's a goal or something. Yeah, like the ambition and also the effort. Hmm. Hmm. Some kind of goal or something? Like Maka, um, does she have a goal? <laughs> oh no. So, so that's why Blair is like sitting on the shoulder of Maka. Oh no, she's going to be like get, oh my god, reminded again. Uh... Hmm. Okay, like who is eating so much? Uh, obviously, Lester. <laughs> He's big in this department as well. <laughs> okay, everyone's here. And symmetrical. Is it symmetrical? Let's see. And here she is. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Yeah, she's getting her results. Yep. Test him. Hmm. Who is this? Oh, okay, the frog and the mouse. I think is that a mouse? Um, I doubt that's going to go well. <laughs> Advice, yeah, definitely, you, you need to listen. Oh, yeah.
Hmm. Okay, yeah, that is a good point. Hmm, yes, okay. Well, no one is here. Like, who is going to like find them? <coughs> Rip it apart. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay, so like the soul wavelength is going to be get transmitted. Okay, so even if no one is here, people are going to sense them. Okay, let's see what happens. And here it is. Yep. Um, I should probably take soul because you don't have a weapon. Well, like if Jesse has um no, what is he doing? But she was not wearing anything un underneath. What the hell? Oh. Wait. Oh my god, okay. Oh yeah, she's wearing. So, uh, is her back like, okay, exposed? Well, this is obvious. Well, it's something like a weapon, I think, like a ready-made weapon. Yeah. Like like a gun. Uh, okay. Well, obviously. Oh no, Maka is here. And she ran away. <laughs> oh no, Tiny is here, okay. So, okay, so she at least like took stand with him, with her. Well, Stein is intelligent. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> She has to like get that fear under control.
okay training time i think oh okay and what was that has the courage to fight fear um like what did she lack i mean i need to know yeah i think like it was like some kind of like conviction or like the the courage um i doubt that is like a time bomb inside you okay who is this <laughs> um <laughs> Okay, so she's going to use her. Well, she has, yeah, obviously. It's a GPS and a time bomb. There's a man I want to really. Which is prison number 13. Whoa, her nail polish. If I met her. Okay. Hmm. Using him to test something. Well, you're understanding that now. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Well, they dug their own grave. Oh god. Okay, let's see his face. Mm. Oh my! <laughs> oh. Okay, he looks like a regular old guy in a prison. Oh, or, or, or is this the guy? Oh my god. Oh, his voice. Okay, so that was the guy. Um, and the other guy, who was he? was probably some kind of... Like... I don't know. Some kind of uh, other character. Well... <laughs> Well, the guy wants to see some comedy. Okay. Mm, like, um, Okay, so in this episode we got to see um, that red little guy which Sol was calling an imp um i don't know like i think it is like some kind of like a hidden power or something okay like this was the end of episode number 12 yeah 12 okay let's see if there is some kind of after credit scene no okay so that was episode number 12 now let's talk about this episode um first of all okay first of all we see that uh, which is banquet or something like uh, whatever they were doing and uh, we got to kind of see the leader i think of the witches i don't know like uh 
the frog which was calling her something maba or something like this that um and uh, okay let's see just a sec if i can find the actual name um okay okay madam demona okay madam demona uh, that is why ma ba like ba is for um old lady ba chan or uh, like that and demona uh, ma mao or mao demon it, it is usually like mao or something like that like demon king and all of that uh, demon king is called mao so like i think they're taking ma from that and ba for like uh, grandma or uh, granny so that is like madame demona so like this madame demona must be like some kind of old witch and uh, uh, like the frog frog which said that um, you stole something out of madame demona's room so like I can't remember if she really like I don't know if like it is it shown whatever that she stole but we'll probably get to see that later on anyways and like these characters have quite the what do you call it courage like um, a frog and a mouse like conspiring against a snake <laughs> okay uh, that is like and here's the thing like um, her tattoo we saw that her tattoo was like there and she took the coat and it was like uh, hidden uh, became hidden after that uh, like these characters kind of like riled her up and she put the, her hand in their mouths and i think that is the way how she transferred those tattoos into their bodies uh, it was also like like for um for a, like what do you call it for a gps purpose and as a like self destruct button she like planted them uh, uh, planted those tattoos inside them so that like she can use by like blackmail them or anything like what she did later on and uh, <laughs> excuse me um and uh, okay after that uh, we see like uh, here's the thing that like, souls a dream which we see like he's like sitting in a room and we see this imp character little imp who comes in like i don't know if uh, like i i doubt i i don't think that he ever like saw these type of dreams and like and he never mentioned it before so like after his blood got contaminated with ragnarok's blood uh, i think this thing started so i as far as i can uh, like uh, i think like this is like something which is the effect of Ragnarok's blood so he is like probably going to get powered up later on and this little imp like is like the what do you call it the main source of the power or like a personification of the power inside him so so as uh, like we see in animes like uh, whenever like this type of hidden power is inside a character like obviously the hidden power which is personified tries to take the character into a dark path, path, path and um, like into a bad direction and uh, I think it is also like trying to do this to soul as well as he said that uh, you have to be like if you want power you can just like what did he say exact thing uh, overwhelming power which will let you forget all your fears then seek power search for the broken rules like he's telling him to like um like do something forbidden like or usually like in these type of animals we see something like forbidden power or like forbidden uh secrets which uh, people usually go for and like they uh, go towards a bad direction because of that so like an evil direction so it, it was basically like telling soul to become evil and uh, try for those like um new levels of power which lie uh, at the end of the evil path or whatever so yeah this is like some kind of like uh, hidden power or something I, I think like after Ragnarok's blood got contaminated and like Medusa is getting quite like uh, like Medusa we saw Medusa here like being uh, a bit surprised because uh, of this and uh, like she is getting a lot of information like she's a nurse 
and like being a school nurse like spying as a school nurse you are going to get a lot of things like a lot of like gossips uh, number one you're going to get gossips from people students and uh, number two you're going to get the medical conditions of students and people like like here like she is doing this for an experiment and what b better place is there to uh, spy on uh, other than the nurse's office like there are all the people who are going to come with problems and like that's the best thing you're going to get a lot of uh, unusual things and unusual cases and you can like use them for experiments and uh, yeah so her work is going well and she wanted some like uh, what do you call it some kind of uh, experiment data she's getting them easily and uh, um, after that we'll see like uh, soul and uh, not so black star like doing the training thing and Stan giving him a uh, uh, so uh, wavelength uh, sucking water with in the, within a pot I think I don't know what its name is anyways and uh, he's going to train so that he can wield uh, Masamune form of uh, Subaki and as Stein said said here that uh, black stars goal is completely different he wants to like be uh, like surpass God he wants to be so powerful like that's an ambition and for that ambition he's going to go as far as he can Marka lacks that I think like um, I doubt she has any ambition if she has I, I don't know but uh, we've never seen like uh, he she has to like make something like her goal otherwise like she for what is she fighting for and I think like um, <laughs> she's probably going to get okay now because like after the thing that happened later on and here we see like stein uh, <coughs> asking maga to like find your thing and then we'll talk and then we have a little party and everything and <laughs> we see that like, blair is living with them i don't know i think with mark and soul like she's, she's like usually as cats does like <laughs> <laughs> they uh, like usually li uh, like lives with the people who feed them and uh, are they feeding her I don't know <laughs> anyways like what does she even eat <laughs> these are questions <laughs> like we <laughs> don't know anyways <laughs> okay so um, okay and then we see Medusa like uh, going through the alleyway and the frog and the rat coming out mouse coming out and obviously like they try to like stop her and obviously like she is a snake and that too a cunning one so she has taken all of the precautions and everything and yes she just switched the time bomb off and like the rat got destroyed and the frog is now being blackmailed <laughs> like what did they even expect like they did not expect like, like they had a good plan like they had a good plan like and they had planned like yeah uh, let me do this in a place where she won't be able to like unleash her power but what can you say she was two steps ahead of them and bad luck and uh, yeah uh, like after this Stein and Maka came out and the frog one ran away and Maka I don't know if Stein uh, like uh, I don't know if Stein like we saw Stein talking to Medusa and I don't know if he suspects something about her suspects something about her being like sketchy or anything like we don't don't see anything like that but I think like she, like Stein is kind of like suspecting her I don't know anyways we're going to see that later on because Stein is obviously a lot like intelligent extremely intelligent so yeah also we like we like Stein's face is not shown no it's shown okay uh, like her his glasses are like white and everything like usually people like anime characters do when they <laughs> get something like uh, <laughs> like when they try to unleash their uh, supreme ultimate power or like when they have some kind of what do you call it mm, new idea or something so I think like Stein kind of suspects them I don't know suspects Medusa we'll see it later on like that is qu extremely like, like quite fishy situation like uh, like as she medusa said that i was just walking and uh, we like i sensed them and so i was going towards them and that itself is a quite a uh, suspicious answer so i think that he might might kind of suspect something i don't know anyways we're probably go going to 
like understand that later on and maka like got her what was that called um sense purpose sense of purpose for uh seeking out power and uh, i think stan is going to train them i think and obviously we'll I, oh okay another thing we see here is like um a new character that is probably going to be introduced in the later episodes and uh, like they were like the frog and uh, the frog was quite uh, like afraid of that character and she was saying that you're going to like release him just because of your experiments so i think it, he is kind of like a big deal he is going to be like a powerful enemy or something and we're going to see and uh, uh number 13 uh, prison number 13 he is like imprisoned in so yeah in the next episodes we're probably going to see what's going to happen so yeah thank you guys for watching this was episode number 12 yes and uh, like this was like an information filled episode nothing much happened and uh, like in the previous episode was so like action-packed and emotion packed so like this is like a nice little break from all of that and we got a lot little lot not a lot of but quite a bit of information and, and everything and we got to know a few new characters as well so yeah that was uh that was like a good type of like break type of episode this was and uh, so yeah as i said thank you guys for watching and uh, if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed and be sure to comment down below whatever you want to say uh, you want to share with uh, about the episode anything you want to say and i'll be back with a new soul eater episode next week yeah next week and um, until then goodbye and have a nice day